Uh, my name is John Leaf. I'm a field agronomist with Agro Liquid Fertilizer Company in St. Johns, Michigan. The things that uh, strip tillers need to keep in mind are, in many respects, the same things that most uh, growers with any system need to keep in mind. Uh, keeping the soil balanced in their, in their chemistry, uh, keep compaction um, moderated, and um, making sure that their crop nutrition is set to meet their yield goals and to meet the conditions of their soil. That, that's really uh, where we need to start. Yeah, soil biology, soil health, uh, all of those things uh, play beautifully together for crop production. Uh, what I like to, to do is to, uh, uh, to talk about the three uh, keys to good soil uh, health, and that's the physical characteristics, things like sand, silt, clay, compaction, things like that. Uh, good soil uh, chemistry, making sure your pH, your, uh, your chemistry bases are all in good shape, and then soil biology. Uh, soil biology is going to um, allow the nutrition that's in the soil to, uh, to become available throughout the course of the growing season uh, and to unlock some of those nutrients that are already bound up in the soil such as phosphorus and calcium. Uh, the, nutri the biology in that soil will, will help uh, break that apart and make uh, phosphorus more available. So it's going to improve the overall health, structure, and uh, uh, productivity of that soil and using all of the, of the components of that soil to help with crop production. Uh, we have the full line of, uh, of crop nutrition products, uh, nitrogen, phosphorus, potassium. Our, uh, starting out in the, in the strips, we can put our phosphorus product, ProGerminator or PrimeAgro P. Or, uh, and our uh, uh, potassium products such as Sure K, Calibrate, or Prime Agro K. Micronutrients, very important uh, part of crop production, uh, especially these days. Sulfur, um, all of those types of products we can put in the strip. We can also put them in the uh, 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 two by two type applications at planting. And we also have a full line of nitrogen products that we can apply uh, strip till and as part of a, uh, an in season. Uh, side dress type application for corn. And then we also have a, uh, a line of products that we can apply as a foliar application in season to uh, as part of a, a, a total nutrient program and to address any uh, specific um, deficiencies that, that we see. We have done a fair amount of research with strip-till applications, varying the time of application, fall versus spring, and the depth of application, either at the surface or like four inches down versus eight inches down. And what we've found is that if we can get our, our phosphorus, our potassium, and our micronutrients at about that four inch uh, depth, four to six inch depth, we can either apply that in the fall or the spring, and that is going to, uh, to provide a very nice base for uh, for the crop nutrition for that year. We found that nitrogen, we really need to have that up in the, uh, in the upper four inches or more of a uh, two by two or surface uh, in order to take best advantage of that. If we can get nitrogen a little bit too deep in a strip till and uh, we lose that, uh, that benefit from, from the strip till application.